What's up, peeps? Think Battle, a.k.a. Nino's Corner, man. First off, if you like this content that is coming your way, hit that subscribe button. It means a lot, man. Go give me uh, a five-star comment, a review, a like. I'll go like and comment on all the videos, folks. It means uh, so much. And if you're listening to this on a podcast, whether it is Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Google Play, Stitcher, Breaker, go give me a comment, a review. Like I said, it means a lot. It helps the channel grow. On my road to 3,000 subscribers, almost there. We're about 40, maybe 30 people short but let's get it folks um but first off guys let's go and talk about our sponsor first folks our sponsor is manscaped folks manscaped it's holiday season and you don't know what to get as a gift or a stocking stuffer well today's sponsor manscaped has the tools to guarantee you win this year's stocking stuffer or white elephant competition manscaped is the leader in men's below the waist grooming and they have served more than four million men worldwide uh, get 20% off and free shipping using the code Nino's Corner at manscaped.com. Again, 20% off and free worldwide shipping using the code Nino's Corner at manscaped.com. You see that guy there in the box, 20% off promo code Nino's Corner at manscaped.com. Also, folks, let's talk about the Nino's Corner line, folks. You guys like to do your merchandise I have, man. Don't be afraid to fail. I'll grow your environment. Understand your brilliance. Get 10% off using the promo code NCPeeps at ninoscornermerch.com. Again, 10% off using the promo code NCPeeps at ninoscornermerch.com. But you guys didn't come here for that. You guys came here to talk about the new recent commitment from Kobe McKenzie out of Lubbock Cooper, uh, Lubbock, Texas, class of 22, um, linebacker, 6'2", 245 pounds, nationally ranked 131st uh, ranked player here in the country per the 247 uh, sports composite rankings, number 13th linebacker in the country, and the number 21 prospect in the state of Texas. What do we like about Mr. Kobe McKenzie, man? What do you like about him, this guy's size, um, his speed, um, yeah, he, he's a big guy, man. He's a thumper. He's a guy, like I said, 6'2", 245 pounds. Linebacker is a position of need. It's a position where we're not as deep as we should be. We are getting over Sean. He's coming back for next year. We got promising players like Jalen Ford and Benda. But we definitely need some linebacker help in this class. And getting a guy like Kobe McKenzie to come here to Texas, and not only did he come here from Texas, he was part of the Flipmas deal, right? The Flipmas is beginning to look a lot like Flipmas. Hey, Flipmas, man. We got him from OU after Lincoln Riley left and bolted and left that program for dry and went to USC. We get Kobe McKenzie to come here to Texas. Like we say, guys, he's a big guy, 6'2", 245. He's very versatile guy, too, as well. Looks like you can play him on the inside. You can play him on the outside because, hey, if he's already between – 235, 245, the kid's going to put on some more weight once he gets to college. Maybe he can be a guy to come off the edge. But you get these players here that look like they can play right now, and you mold those guys into the player that you want them to be. And I think it's going to be a pretty decent player and a pretty good player here at Texas. It's good to get the linebacker depth. It's what we need. Um, you know, We need linebackers. We need offensive linemen. We need some defensive linemen as well. And I think we shored up the defensive line here already for the 2022 class. We're doing very well there. Um, but linebacker is a position where we need folks. And to secure a guy like uh, Kobe McKenzie here to the Longhorns is ideal. Like I said, we are very lacking right now in the linebacker position. And to get guys like him of his quality, of his ilk, is something that we definitely need here on the 40 acres. Like I said, national top 131 player, part of 247 composite, uh, number 13th ranked linebacker in the country, number 21 player in the state. Love the pickup. Let's go take a look at his film. That receives where number two, he's highlighted there. Big kid, look at him coming down. Good speed, track him down, make the hit. Here he is, kind of on the outside where the left tackle is, between left tackle and the guard. S scans across, interception, take to the house, baby. Take to the house, touchdown. Easy work, easy work. Line up there, middle linebacker there. Reese the defense, look at him, comes across, diagnosed the play, bam, got him. Another awesome play here. I'm not going to fake him out. Hey, he likes to put <laughs> some hat on some players, man. I like his game. Diagnosed to play very well. Knocks out to guy. Easy play for him. Across. Bye-bye quarterback. There he is. Blitzing. Hits the gap. 
gets his guy, sticks with the guy, perfect. Diagnosis the ball. There you go. Strip and recover. Awesome play. That's what you want. That's what you want. Our guys always trying to make a play for themselves and their team as well. Great play. Pop. And a fumble. I know the linebacker. Scan, scan, scans. Bam. Hey, man. Great vision. Great vision. Let's look at a couple more plays here. I think the highlight reel is only about three minutes or so. Awesome. Almost got an interception himself, one-handed. Another play, shoots the gap. Look at that. Ah, uh, by quarterback. Get him on the ground. Bam, and a fumble. Uh, next play, what's he going to do here? He's lined up in the middle. Uh, nice vision, nice vision. Diagnosed the play. Uh, gets off his lineman out of him and then makes the play on the runner. Line up in the middle again. Off the left guard, shoots the gap by quarterback. Um, next, I'm in the middle again. Diagnosis to play. Perfect diagnosis. Get the running back. Way to go. Another good play here. Shoots, bam, got him. Easy play for him. Diagnosis to play again. Look at him. Running back. Uh, <laughs> quarterback wants to do a stain. He's like, I ain't getting hit. <laughs> he just slid. He will no no parts of that. No parts of that. Nice hit. Big physical guy, man. Big physical. Got some dog in him. We love it. We love it here at Texas, guys, with some dog. <laughs> that running back wanted no parts state either. Uh, next play. Where we at? Where we at? All right. Let's see what he does here. Um, running back. Sorry, son. Get out of here. Good play, man. Middle linebacker there. Diagnosis. The Bam. Got him. It's exactly what you want, man. You want your guy to fill the gap. You want your guy to be physical. Uh, you're seeing the kind of players that Coach – bam, nice hit. You're seeing the kind of players that Coach PK wants here in his defense. Uh, Jeff Chote as well. He is the linebacker's coach. Um, so, yeah, you're seeing big physical guys that are very versatile, can play numerous positions where it's inside or out. Nice hit. Nice hit. Nice hit. A couple more plays here. I like the kid's game. I like his game. It's not flashy. It's not meant to be flashy. It's meant to get the job done well. That's what he's doing. Still sticks with the play. Still sticks with the play. Uh, make sure get that boy down five yards behind the line of scrimmage. All right, folks. Now, we just saw the film from Kobe McKenzie, four-star linebacker out of Lubbock Cooper, 5A school. Um, his team went deep into the playoffs, if I'm not mistaken. I think they went 13-1 this year, 5-0 uh, in the district, if I'm not mistaken. However, what we are going to say about this kid is he is very versatile. And you can see him playing inside. You can see him playing outside. He's big, 6'2", 245. If those weight numbers are correct, this is a guy who can possibly put on some weight also and be a guy who can play jack, um, You know, meaning that he can be that outside presence, that hybrid defensive end slash outside linebacker. Um, he, he can play middle linebacker as well. He can put on more weight and, you know, maybe bump down and put his hand in the ground a little bit. You know, it, it just depends on how his body fills out. And his body type is the type of body type that can fill out. It just depends on where Coach PK, where uh, Jeff Choke actually want to put this guy. But you, you got to be impressed with his film. And it's even better uh, that he, he has great film, but it's even better that we got him from Oklahoma too. That's great flip in the season right here, guys. Um, so like I said before, it's beginning to look a lot like flipness. Hopefully we get some more recruits coming here. Um, hopefully more, more names to come here on, on the horizon here prior to National Signing Day on the 15th of December. But great pickup from, from uh, the Longhorns, getting Kobe McKenzie here, four-star linebacker. Like, like I said, guys, love it, Cooper. Uh, Lubbock, Texas, number 131 national ranked player here in the country, number 21 player in the state, number 13 linebacker. Um, it's good to see him on live. I think everybody kind of knew that he was going to commit here. He was on the live sessions with uh, Derek Brown and Justice, uh, you know, Finkley, um, Stone, um, 
Champ Lewis also, if I'm not mistaken. So we all kind of knew that this was happening, but it's good to see that this guy got his got his shine here, uh, got his edit out, and um, and is now an official member of the 2022 class for the Texas Longhorns. Um, looks like the defensive uh, you know recruiting here is is really picking up pretty well. Uh, great defensive lineman. Now we're getting um, a great linebacker here in this class, and we're actually showing this class up pretty well. So good on that, guys. Hook them all day long, man. Like in all my podcasts, do you. Don't be afraid to fail. I'll grow your environment. I understand your brilliance, man. Nino's Corner, I'm out.